opened in 2020 and immediately one of the main attractions here on the Las Vegas Strip. Welcome everyone to Allegiant Stadium. Daniel Carlson ready to get us started. And away we go at Allegiant Stadium. And a decent return ends as they bring him down inside the 30. All right, let's get this show on the road. It is first and 10. Throwing to start this game. He keeps those feet in and makes the catch. He's just one of those guys, Kate. Even when he's not open, he's still a target thanks to that physicality and his ability to just play bully ball. They don't like forcing into coverage, but sometimes when you've got a bully like him that can create space, you just find a way to get him the ball. The give here on second. And he'll get it up near the 38-yard line before going down. They'll say he got five there, but Brock, all they care about is the first down that comes with it. It's got to be so demoralizing as a defense when you go up against a running back who just keeps those legs churning like a piston in an engine. And that effort's contagious. This entire offense is getting a boost when he busts those tackles. Play action on first down. Caught on the left side. And he goes out, just needed one more step there to reach midfield. That is the epitome of staying on schedule. That kind of completion right there on first down. Well, it opens up the entirety of the playbook for second down. And the third and short in your back pocket, you can get even more aggressive and take that shot. Hand off on second and short. And he made a bid for midfield there, but stopped on his own side at the 49. That's a short gain of one. And it'll give the Panthers a first down. Hey, I know the temptation is there. If I'm thinking in the booth, I know that play caller is too. That could have been a chance to be aggressive. Not the case. Go get the first down like they did, and the new set of downs to work with. Young throwing here. He finds Johnson. And he has it to the 42 before they make the stop. I feel so bad. I really do. And I don't mean this sarcastically, Kate. <laughs> I feel bad for these guys in coverage. I don't know how you defend some of these players today. Because they get that drag route. They get one step inside of you. Well, there's very little you can do other than make the tackle. Second and one. Connects with Johnson. And he takes it inside the 35 before heading out. Give him nine on that play, and it's enough for the first. I'm sure coach and play caller doesn't mind making the job a little bit easier. You know, play calling's a lot simpler and easier when you count on the offense to move the chains on those early downs. Now it's Young. This is reeled in by Leggett. And he takes it across the 30 before heading out. Every once in a while, it's fine to be conservative on first down, especially when you get enough to stay on schedule and get a little something coming out of it, too. Halfway to the marker. It's second and five. Feeling the receiver in motion left. They don't get this snapped in time. This is going to back them up. Man in motion wasn't set in time. Just couldn't get a snap away before the play clock expired. Back to the line they go. It's second down. Tight end in motion right. Second and ten now. Short pass caught by his tight end. A flag's down as he stops. Looks like this one's on the offense. A game they were pretty happy with goes away via the penalty. And now we're going to wait to see how they respond. So now a much tougher task here as they come up on second and twenty. Tight end reels in the shallow throw. And that will not be enough for a first down. Oh. 
So through one, this game, more for you defensive maestros out there. A couple of zeros on the board right now. We'll return to Allegiant Stadium right after this. We're ready to go with the second quarter. It's Panthers football. They'll need a big play to continue a nice drive. It's third and very long. Pressure comes, and he's taken down. The Raiders got him. And the defense comes through to back him up ahead of fourth down. All right, first sack on the board on the first drive as a defense. And now, well, now we let the chess match begin. The adjustments begin because we know pressure leads to sacks. And sacks in this league often leads to wins. Fourth down, and on comes the punt team, and the kick's away. And he can't hurt you with the return if you just kick it out of bounds, right? This one flies out right around the 15-yard line. Offense ready to begin this drive, first and ten. the shotgun they'll give it to him inside and he found some running room for a nice game it's a solid 70 yard pickup on first down now they're gonna have second and three i'm not kidding you kate a run of that length at the nfl level honestly is the equivalent of a run of 15 plus at the high school level it's hard in the run game to make yards and they just got a very successful one from the 22 on second down into the hands of tucker complete and they're going to bring him down just beyond the 30 at the 31. That's a pickup of nine. And that's good for a Raiders first. That's just great instincts. Go air it out on second down rather than just play conservative and run it. They hit a weak point in the coverage and don't need to worry about third down at all. Back to throw. Minshew. Got a man over the middle. Complete. And they'll take him down at the 43-yard line. Pickup of 12 on that play. And that's a Vegas first down. I love throwing on first down. And when you see a first down pass just like that, it's taking advantage of a matchup you plan for and you go out and execute. Here's Minshew. He's on the move. He's on the move. Decent yardage picked up here before he slides down to avoid the tackle. Here's second and two. Short pass caught by his tight end. A solid gain there. Gets him across the 45 before he goes out. He gets six on that play. And that's good for a Raiders first. Look up contested catch in the football dictionary, and you'll see that. I mean, I can't critique the defense there. They're in the hip pocket of that tight end. But these contested catches, these tight ends that can separate with their hands, utilize their body, even when you're covered, you're not. As a defense, you got to see the pass. You got to time up your hit, and you got to jar that ball loose. Not a lot of offensive players are hanging on to that one through a well placed hit. Couldn't connect on first, it's second down. Minshew. He's going to get this complete to his running back. And he has them a first down, which they will tackle on the other side of this two-minute warning. He picks up 15 on the play. And that's a Vegas first down. You know what I like about that, Kate? I like that they're not coming out slow. They're willing to go with some looks here that will yield big yardage down the field instead of just settling for dinking and dunking the ball. Defender arrives right as the ball does, and the hit knocks it free. Incomplete. See the pass, time up your hit, and jar that ball loose. Not a lot of players are hanging on through a well-placed hit like that one. So after the incompletion, here comes the second down call. He'll throw it yet again. 
throw reeled in by Mayer. Decent gain here, but short of the first. Sometimes when you're just looking to move it forward, get some small yards on a throw, quarterback's best friend, security blanket. And when it's a big old tight end, that's an extra bonus. An extra corner into the game for the Panthers. Third down. Minshew to throw. And that's incomplete. He's going to wish he hung on to that pick there, but it's still going to bring up fourth down. Oh, that was such an opportunity lost. They were looking for a way out without giving up any points on the series. And instead, well, he just couldn't quite hang on. And it is good. No problems there on the shorter attempt. And that's going to break our tie and give them a three-point advantage. Well, I know once that drive stalls out, that's where it really pays to have that reliable kicker on the sideline ready to bail you out. And he knocks that one right through to give him the lead. Carlson all set now for the kickoff. Return coming from the six. And he's brought down. The offense will come onto the field. Well, we've already seen some nice plays here, and we're going to see plenty more before this game ends. But you might be thinking, with plays like that, my guy's ratings should be better. Well, you're not alone. you got a chance to let the Madden Ratings Hotline know just what you're thinking. Give them a call. 1-844-MADDEN-1. And make your case for who should get a boost. Young to throw it. It's caught. That's Thielen. And he's short of the first after a mild game. Now we get a timeout by the Panthers. It's their first. They'll have two left to work with before halftime. After a good pickup, they've got second and four. Looking to throw, Young. Thielen's got it, complete. And he'll get it up near the 38-yard line before going down. The drive picks up here, first and ten. Young looking to throw. And his perfect start is over. And that's the first one of his throws to wind up incomplete. I think that was a throw, Kate, that just came a little bit too late. What it did is it gave that defense time to come up and deliver a pop and knock the ball loose before he could secure it fully. No dice on that prior pass. Here's second down. Shotgun snap. They're going to throw. Throw complete to Thielen. And he got this close to midfield before going out. That's an 11-yard pickup, and it gives them the first down. Kid, I can't tell you how good that is. Anticipating the outcut, having the ball on the way before the receiver's head even turns, he puts it on him so that receiver can easily get out of bounds for the nice game. Here's Young to throw. Escapes the pocket. Stepping up, and he's going to run. Now the Panthers decide to spend their third and final timeout. And that's all they've got for what little remains of this half. New set of downs for him at the 38. Back to throw. Here's Young. And that's incomplete with seven seconds left. Time for one, maybe two more snaps. Those passes get more and more difficult as you try to get aggressive downfield. I love the call. I love pushing the ball down the field. But the windows and the throwing lanes aren't there long. And it only takes a little bit for a throw to be off. It, it's no good. And they are unable to tie up this contest. That's a kick right there, Kate, that defies explanation and analysis. But at the very least, if you're going to try a field goal on an early down, 
You gotta make it. That's embarrassing. One last play before the break. Throwing it just before halftime. He finds the open man there, complete. We're at halftime here in Vegas. The Raiders defending their building thus far. Now we're on to Orlando. Jonathan Coachman ready to bring us the EA Sports Halftime Report. All yours, Coach. Take it away. His return starts at the five. And he gets across the 30 before he's brought down. Oh, there's no question about it, Kate. That just infuses everybody. A little more bounce in your step now, both in and out of the huddle. And you want to pay off your special teams that set you up for success. It's a new set of downs for him at the 32. They'll run here on first down. And he's going to get up to about the 33, but no more. Manages just a yard on first down. Now it's going to be second and nine. The one thing I could say positive about the execution of that play is at least he didn't go backwards. They'll come to the line here, second and nine. Throwing from the gun. He gets this one to Myers. And this one's brought to a halt at about the 36-yard line. Third and six for them to figure out now. Minshew looking to throw. Along the sideline, he brings it in. They say he got the feet down, too. Excellent work. It's a gain of 12 there. And that's good for a Raiders first. You're not going to last long in the National Football League if you don't convert a good chunk of your third downs. Nice find there to continue the series. Now Minshew. Got a man over the middle. Complete. And they're going to haul him down just shy of the 40. And they come through with a nice gain of 10 and a first down. <laughs> that is what elite offenses are all about. Why worry about three downs when you need only one? Move the chains in one play and keep driving that defense backwards. Still sticking with the passing game. He'll get this to Tucker. And he gets it down to the 35 before stepping out. Second and three now. Here's a give up the middle. And they take him down right along the 30. It's a four-yard gain, and that's going to get him across the marker and earn the first. I don't know about you, Kate, but he sure made getting that first down look really easy. A lot easier than it's supposed to be for that defense. And I think they'll hear about it when they get to the sidelines. First and ten now from the 30. Throwing here, Minshew. He's taken down. The Panthers' rush gets home. And the big play drives them backwards. Second down coming up. Wow, it has been such a good day offensively for the guys up front. That's actually the first sack by this defense. And now comes the real question mark. Will it lead to more? Or will this offense learn a lesson and get back to the rhythm they've been in protecting? They'll run now on second down. And he stopped after getting this down inside the 35. Looks like to the 33. That run gets him seven. It's going to bring up third and 12. Well, that doesn't net a first down. You get yards like that in the run game, you will take it in the NFL. This drive in some serious trouble. It's third and 12. So we hit the end of the third quarter. It's the Raiders' ball. A chance at a win if they can hang on to this lead.
This drive in some serious trouble. It's third and 12. Minshew setting up to throw. He's on the move. Oh, he's going to run for it. Oh, he lost the football. Panthers pick this one up. And the drive will start out with a first and ten. Out of the gun. They'll give it to him inside. And that's only one yard up the middle. Got to be second down. Okay, this is why you got to be careful to just run it always on first down. You got to break your tendencies. The casual fan, well, that casual fan knew what was coming. But more importantly, this defensive front did too. They'll come to the line here, second and nine. Young throwing here. Rifles it, and it's caught. And he's brought down after a nice gain and a first down. It sure seemed like he knew exactly where he was going with that right off the snap. Markers reset, ball at the 37. Now Young. Open receiver, caught. And he does quite a bit of damage before they finally take him down. You know, Kate, we often talk about flipping the field in special teams, right? A, a kick return, a good punt. Well, an explosive play like that does the exact same thing. Look at the difference in field position by hitting on that shot. You've totally flipped the field and the tone of this drive. From the red zone now. Gets this to Johnson. And he's going to be tackled, but still all the way down to the six. It's a real solid pickup, 12 yards, and it rewards him with a first and goal. You know, it sure seems like he knew exactly where he was going with that before the snap. That's a pre-snap decision that led to a post-snap first down. Now it's Young. He's got it. And he's going to score. Touchdown, Carolina. The Panthers jump in front late. A chance to take their lead beyond a field goal on this point after. That one right down the middle. And they'll continue adding to their lead. Now Pinheiro on to handle the kickoff. Return coming from the six. And in the end, he's able to get it to what used to be a touchback. It's at the 25 after the return. The Raiders have their offense back out there. They find themselves down here in the fourth after that touchdown. This game could end up depending on how they respond right here. They'll get this drive started. First and ten. Looking to throw it. This is hauled in by Myers. And he's going to get this up to the 45 before he's brought down. And now the Raiders call for the first of their timeouts. And they can take a moment to try to build more momentum after getting that first. Just one play into this drive, and they're already sitting on their own 45. On first down, they'll run. And he gets a gain of nine, and that's going to take us to the two-minute warning. Just a little short, but still a nine-yard pickup. That's going to bring up second and one. So much to like about that run, Kate, particularly what he was able to get out of it. The defense, I think, feels a little fortunate they were able to track him down before an even bigger run and crossing that first down marker. Now to throw. Pass is hauled in by the running back. We'll head out of bounds after a small game. This one goes for three yards. 
And that's a Vegas first down. A play like this, that's exactly where you want to get him the ball, right on the outside, where he's got the space and a lot more room to work. Throwing now. Short pass caught by his tight end. And that tackle stops him after a solid gain. Well, that's a pretty similar result to a first down run play. Moves it forward, keeps you on schedule, and makes second and third down a whole lot easier to manage. Keeping that pace going as the clock continues to run. To throw. Got a man over the middle, complete. And he's going to be stopped at the 17-yard line. A timeout taken by Vegas. That's it, second. Still one more in their pocket to use. To the line for a new set of downs. Only a lone timeout at their disposal. Here he is to throw. He's taken down. The Panthers rush gets home. And the big play drives them backwards. Second down coming up. That sure ended up being a worst-case scenario. Pass rush just kept coming and coming and bearing down. And he was looking for an escape that wasn't there. It's one of those plays in hindsight, Kate, where you really got to understand, I got to cut bait, cut my losses, and avoid such a negative play. Buys time, rolling right. And they finally bring him down, but that is a big gain and a new set of downs. This offense in position now. It's first and goal. Here he is to throw. And this one won't be caught, but we got a flag here. Looked like there may have been some early contact before that throw arrived. So a little too much contact on the part of the defender, and the officials flag him for it. They'll break the huddle and come up on first and goal. Setting up to pass. should win this game. Absolutely clutch score there, Brock, as they take the lead here in the final minute. Incredible execution. The moment not too big for any of them. And, Kate, they cashed in when it really mattered. That one splits the uprights. And they'll continue adding to their lead. In. All set now for the kickoff. He's going to bring this one out. And this drive will start inside the 25. Hey, Kate, the best kick returners I was ever around, really at any level, they want this opportunity. They want their chance to help their team. They know they're down, but they also know that return, especially a good one like this, can set the offense up for success. They're out and set. First and ten. One final shot here. A bit of desperation on this deep shot. And this one falls incomplete. No miracles on the final drive today. This game is over. So put this in the win column for the Raiders. And there was no easy enough. It took some white knuckling until the very end, but their defense carried that small lead through to the finish line as they escape with the victory. So for Brock Heward and all of our crew, I'm Kate Scott, wrapping up another edition of the NFL on EA Sports. The Raiders winners as we bid you farewell from Las Vegas.